with another unboxing video. This is P. Let's go ahead and get into it. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe now so that way you can stay up to date with all the latest unboxing and unpackaging videos. Today we'll be taking a look at a package, a product that was ordered through eBay, eBay deals. So check them out every day. Scroll through. This is in the clothing section, men's shoes. So let's get into it. Let's start snatching this open without damaging the product, of course. Start slicing it. As you can see, the brand is Puma. And this is my first time ever ordering or consuming or having um, this brand. Although I've always looked at them, always acknowledged them. And this is a part of history um, as far as sneakers. So I wanted to have at least one in the stash and I may order a newer style, but this is gonna be a classic. Um, this is actually from Heritage's Heritage Kicks Incorporated from New York. And let's see. These are gonna be the Puma Men's Black and White Suede Classic. And I think I got these for about I don't know, I think it was about thirty nine, thirty four, somewhere between thirty four and forty four bucks. So yeah, Heritage Kicks Incorporated out of New York. You can check them out at heritagekicks at gmail.com or check out eBay deals of the day. Uh, well, eBay deals daily. Scroll through, check out their store, see what they got. But anyway, we have this green box with the Puma on top. Jumping hard, tail in the air. And right here on the side, and on the back, you have that red sticker. And on the bottom, you have the size conversion table. So that's cool to have in the stash, so you'll know. Especially with women and men, especially women that want to wear men's sneakers because of the colorways, because of the look, uh, due to athleticism. Um, same way with men. Um, if you can, sometimes these colorways that women have matches up good with the purples and, you know, the traditional women or girl colors. So, anyway, enough of that. Spin it around. Let's take a look at this. So, here's the sizes <clears throat> in U.S. Of course, I got this in a nine and a half. The Suede Classic Plus. I wear anywhere between nine and ten, so I just hit it in the halfway mark since I wasn't familiar. Never purchased any of these before. See the little vent. Push in with the cat. The Puma Panther. I'm going to take the top. Flip it open. See the white paper. Yeah. Oh man, this looks awesome. Let me see if I can get this up a little higher. So you can check this out with me. All right. On point. Classic throwback. Oh, it comes with two pearl laces. And one is super fat. Oh, this is out of this world. <laughs> to me. And hopefully to you. So as you can see. That gold shining, white sold with the texture around to the front, the bottom, the axis, puma in the middle. Take a look at the toe box and the suede. The suede is thick, so you definitely want to purchase some type of protector. Hopefully you wouldn't want to wear these out in the rain. I'm not going to. I didn't know these was going to look that good. I was just going to wear these as something to toss on. I might should have doubled up. You see the off-white Puma emblem. 
logo in the suede. Pull on to the back, pull them on the bottom. Cat and gold. <laughs> these are on point. God, I should have been got some of these. Good quality and craftsmanship in making this shoe. Check out the tongue. They even got the little plastic going over it. And green. So if you want to wear a white black with a little bit of green or like some camo, definitely will match up. Let's take a look at the sole. Fire. Look at the bed of the shoe. Then you have this white. And the insole. Crispy white. So definitely bust those white socks. Now I see why there's so many Puma collectors out there. They get these classics. Let's take a look at the back of the tongue. These are crisp. I'm not really on black shoes like that, but when I said I wanted to add one in the collection, I had to get my first pair as a classic. Classic colorway. You guys, got to tell me what you think. Black laces? Flat? Or the white super wide laces? Look how fat these laces are. It's unreal. Black jeans all day. Black jean shorts. Get the Puma pants. The active wear pants. The sweats in black. Baggy, skinny leg. Your preference. These do look like I got. I picked the right size for me. Because the 10 may have been too long. It's sort of narrow in the front. Even if you're going to dress it up in the black and white, you could stunt these on the low. I'm definitely feeling this sneaker in person. Definitely worth 65 but hopefully you all, if you are thinking about purchasing these, you can shop around and find them. 36 40 44 And I'm not mad at the 65 if that was the price. Now, looking at the quality of this suede, see the little perforation on the side, hopefully. Just a little air perforation. None on the toe box, but it's all good. You may not be wearing these long. Hope you enjoyed this video. This is the Puma Suede Classic. Heritage Kicks. Shout out to them. Check out eBay deals. Or if anything, if they're not available, check out Puma.com. You can check out through PayPal. Or credit card. Once again, this is P. Give me that thumbs up. Never down. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you like this shoe. Tell me if you have it in the collection. Tell me if you got doubles or triples. Let's have some fun with it. Share the video. Most importantly, subscribe. Help the movement move. Um, and more than likely, if you subscribe, I'll subscribe to your channel. Return the favor. Thanks for checking me out. Be on the lookout for more unboxing and unpackaging videos. Cheers.